I am a Kentuckian, I am a human rights activist, and I am a person of faith, and I support fairness. Reverend Donzella Lee was just one of a handful of advocates for the state's Fairness Now campaign, backed by legislation that would extend protections against the LGBT communities. I think that it's definitely an issue, and I think that they should be given the same rights as everybody else. They're American citizens just like everybody else. But this group of Kentuckians say they continue to witness discrimination in the workforce as well as housing and other public services. There's a job I'm going to interview for Friday and my friend told me that I should tone down my sexuality because they will make sure that I don't get that job. What do we want? If they find out, they find out. I won't flaunt it, but I'm not going to hide who I am just for a job. I grew up with a lesbian sister, and so I know discrimination firsthand. She suffered from bullying and not being accepted for who she was, so that's why I'm here today supporting her and all my other gay friends. Today's rally came a day after hundreds of people merged at the Capitol for a rally of Christian supporters standing firm on traditional American values. Right now, Representative okay. Tim Moore, a Republican was, from Elizabethtown, uh, is urging the governor Kentucky and attorney general to appeal a federal court judge's decision that overturned the state's majority. On a constitutional amendment that would have made sure that we defined marriage as between a man and a woman. This was passed by the Kentucky legislature, signed by the governor, and went forward to our people here in the Commonwealth for a vote. And they overwhelmingly voted in favor of that amendment. One judge at the federal level has sought to overturn the will of the Commonwealth of Kentucky and of all of our people. Aside from same-sex marriage, Moore says state laws already provide protection to people fearing discrimination. I think that we have guaranteed equality all throughout our society. I mean, that has been a long-standing, not only tradition, but it's protected in law. For this group, it's not enough. Luckily, I've been blessed enough to not have to deal with any discrimination based on my sex orientation. I have. Uh, have discrimination based on my race, of course, but I mean, it doesn't matter if I've been through it or not, it's just the fact that we need to be out there supporting everyone. I just think there's no true freedom until we're all equal.